Hey everybody, it's Sarge, and welcome to an ace tanker battle. Today, we're looking at the German Tier 8 medium tank, the M48A2 Rompanzer. This is the unskinned, unawakable version of the trademarked Hot Wheel Monster Tank, the Dread Dozer. Based on our research and looking at all the details, we found no difference between the Hot Wheel Dread Dozer and this tank. We've taken this tank into battle 44 times. We've had an above average 59% win rate, a very nice 38% survival rate, and we're up to 63% on our first mark of excellence. The armor on this tank is not bad. The plow blade serves as 30 millimeters of spaced armor, protecting that upper and lower plate. But the strongest and thickest part of this thing is the front face of the turret. It gets up to 254 millimeters. But don't forget, you got that big ugly cupola that's a weak spot right on top of that turret. So if you're going haul down, be careful. The Rompanzer gets up to 40 kilometers an hour. The gun size is 9 centimeters, or 90 millimeters. Reload time starts out at 8.7 seconds, which gives you just about 7 rounds a minute, which isn't too bad. You have 9 degrees of gun depression, which is pretty good. The Alpha ammo is AP and it'll pen 212 millimeters of enemy armor. The Premium Bravo ammo is a very nice APCR and it'll pen 259. So running the APCR will give you an extra 47 millimeters of pen. You're going to hit the enemy for about 280 hit points on average. The shell velocity for the APCR is 1177 meters a second, which is a lot better than the Alpha ammo. The accuracy is an OK.38 and the aim time starts at 2.3. So it's not a derpy gun, it's a pretty good tank. Now let's get onto the battlefield and show you how it can perform. Alright, Cliff. Not a bad map. This map gives you a couple decision points you need to make. Do you want to go up top and fight in the flats? Maybe rush up onto Lighthouse Hill? Nah, with this tank I think we're going to go over here and look down the 1-2 line. There are four light tanks on the enemy team, so we're going to get over here and we're going to play it a little bit safe, try and use our spotting range, but at the same time, wait for the YOLO. There's one, T41E1, we get a snap in for 263. Good hit, there's number two. Can we get a lead the shot? Pow! We missed. All right, number three and number four probably went up to the hill, back side. Let's get another shot into the Hawk right there. Oh, we missed. I should just auto-lock. Hmm. Alright, alright, alright. Take it easy. <laughs> They've got a tank destroyer. they got a lot of tanks. I, You always expect the sniper schnitzels to be sitting back there in the bush. we got to look out. That light tank came around. He's coming around looking at us. Pow. Nope. I think we hit the track, but we did not do damage. We're getting a little assist here. Can we pen the HMH M51? We did get a snap into the HMH. We got 900 assist. That's good stuff. Just what we were looking for. Perfect. Perfect. All right. We're down by two, so we don't want to go rushing up there real fast yet. The camo rating versus the view range on this tank not really good. You don't have a whole lot of camos is what I'm trying to say. Snap into the VK3601. We hit him. For being a medium tank, you don't have a lot of camo. We need to get up here and get hauled down behind these rocks. There's no enemy already. We own... Uh-oh. 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 Rush. Go, 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 go. 283. Udez shot us. We bounced a shot. They hit that front snow plow, so that helps. Keep going. Keep going. A snap for 320. Oh, goodness. All right, like I was saying, we've got the hill somewhat controlled on our back left side, so that allows us to push up here. And with no arty, I think we're safe to come up there. I was a little slow pulling back there. Who else is up there? We're trying to get some more spotting assist. Always comes down to spotting assist for an ace tanker battle. You want to get up there. You want to use your camo, view range, armor, whatever you got to play it safe, play it smart, and spot the enemy. I got a feeling we're going to take a little bit of damage here. We've gotten 2,500 assist. That's beautiful. Man, he's undetected. That tank destroyer is OP in the 
camo category. There he is. Who is? And it's twice. Took out my driver. Light tank on the top right side. Watch, Tiger. Light tank, light tank, Tiger. Snap a Tiger. Pow. 279. He hits us for a little bit. Not a lot. We're up by three. 10 to 7. Boy, this battle is going fast. It's only been four minutes. Not even four minutes. Let's get a snap into the M56. Oh, doggone it. APCR is pretty good ammo, but that was not the velocity we were looking for. Snap. 295 into the Tiger P. 5 to 9. We're up by 4. It's going pretty good, man. We've racked up a lot of assist and some pretty good direct damage. Can we get a snap in? We got him. 9 to 4. 9 to 4. There's the final four red tanks. We see where they're at. They're on our left side up the hill, so we're going to have to get on our horse and get it going. Let's go. Up the hill, we want to get in a little bit more damage. We've got 2443 direct damage, 2800 assist. So that gives us around, what, 50, 5200? We want more. Want more. Even one more pen. Just give us one more penetration. It matters. It really makes a difference. We got a lot of hit points left. We got at least half our health left, so that's good. They got a light tank. Their heavy tank is gone, so they got two lights and a medium. We can get up on that TVP VTU. Get up there, get a shot in. Hmm. Speed's not too bad. We're getting up to around 28 kilometers an hour going up this hill. That's okay. Good traction in the snow, up the hill. Where's he at? Let's go. He sees us. He's locked on to us. Oh, he's behind the... Behind the snow pile. Can we get a shot in? Give me one more shot. Come on. Give us one more. Run, run, run. Go, go, go. Get a lot. Get a green reticle, red reticle there. Snap it. Oh, you got to be kidding me. This thing doesn't do very well on the move as far as snapshots. Get another shot in there. Pow. Ramming. Reload time on this. We got it down to 6.5 seconds. I'll take that. Still a light tank out there somewhere. I would think if it's a light tank... Hmm. I wonder if he's on that little ledge down there by Alpha 6-7, down by the water. Could be on the lighthouse. We'd be detected, though, I think. We might be proxy spotted if he's on the lighthouse. We need to check down by the water, I think. I'm debating. I don't want to miss out. I want one more shot in. We got 58, 5,900 combined. That's pretty good for a Tier 8. Everybody's running to the left. They're going over towards our spawn. I don't see him over there. Let's go look over the ledge. If he's over here, we'll drop on him. Keep an eye on the mini-map. If he pops up, we got to turn and go. Where you at? Where you at? You down there? Hello? Hello? No? Huh. All right, let's go back over here. Maybe he's right over here and everybody just drove by him. If we don't see him at the end of the game, we'll... Oh, there he is. There he is. A over 237. We can get one shot into him. We can knock him off the board. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's down behind the cliff. Dog on it. We capped. Are you kidding me? 7-1 to one in the green team caps. Come on. We got an MVP. Three kills. 3,086 damage. 1730 XP. That's pretty good. We got 3, 4, 5, 58, 5,900 combined. We blocked 12, 10. What did we get? We got the ace tanker. Boom, 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 boom. That's what I'm talking about right there. Pretty good battle. Not a bad tank. It doesn't do great against tier 10s, but it's a pretty good tier 8 tank.